What is going on everybody? My name is Japes and welcome to another episode of my Path to Power. We're up to episode number 63 right now. Thank you guys for your support on my previous career mode episode out earlier today. We've got our season ticket pack and lo and behold we get David Alaba who is Bayern Munich's uh, young left back, center mid, left wing, wherever he can play anywhere out on the pitch. But he's a left back in ultimate team, and he was uh, actually taken under Frank Ribéry's wing in tutelage when he first went to Bayern Munich. There's a little Bayern fun fact for you guys. Uh, but we try to sell everybody else on, and we'll sell Alaba on as well. He should get us a few thousand coins because he is the paciest left back in the Bundesliga this year as a as uh, as far as gold left backs go. But we got to play contract on Agbana, and we are heading into a season's match we're currently four points shy of promotion with uh i think three games remaining um is where no it's yeah maybe three games remaining i'm not quite sure maybe five games remaining and we're four points shy i'm not quite sure uh where we are exactly but we're getting things started he makes a huge error with david Luiz and kind of jerks his joystick in the wrong direction and it's just enough space for carlos tevez to break free and rifle a near post finish in in the 15th minute giving us the early one to nil lead and he was on his back foot from this point forward. Though that 4-3-1-2 team we've obviously struggled with before. It's one of those things where the center forward and two strikers match up very well against my three center back combinations. And if they're very, very pacey or they're quick and they make, you know, good quality runs to space my players out, there is an opportunity for them to get in behind. And that's just a bizarre goal that Cambiasso scores. We're not going to question it. We're absolutely going to take it. And I'm going to show you the replay on that real quick so you can judge for yourself what exactly exactly happened here. Is it a keeper error? I'm not totally sure. It, he, he seems to dive over the top of the ball, which was just bizarre, but I'm smashing A right here to try to skip through the scenes and I get my pocket picked. I didn't mean to pass it out. You guys know that I use X to pass it out or square on PS3 to do a chip ball out wide. That's usually my game plan because, uh, if you, if you chip it out, it's even if they do intercept it, you still have players that get back in time and read it, that it's not that big of a deal. And nine times out of 10, you're going to keep possession of it. But Gaetan doing some nice work getting up the wing here. He's going to eventually make his way and do a lovely little chip ball to Pastore, who tries to hit the volley. Goes right to the keeper, but falls to Lissandro Lopez. 80th minute goal, and we are on our way to victory. And we're going to take all three points from this match, which is exactly what we needed to get. Uh, actually, I guess we can't get promoted because we're in Division 1. We're, uh, we're working towards the title here. And he steals one back with David Silva. It was kind of a frustrating goal, but we'll take it nonetheless. And there we... Okay, so now we have three games remaining and we're four points shy at this point. And so, you know, we're going to have to get the total of four points. We can get a win and a draw in our last three games, and that'll be enough. Obviously, we'd like to go for two wins, seal the deal, be done with it, and not look back, not think about it from that point. We're sitting at 66, 3, and 10. Uh, with a few disconnects thrown in there. 175,000 coins, not too shabby, and we've got a wonderful side. We'll sell on Marco Royce, and uh, I'm thinking about actually bringing Neymar into the side and maybe changing out that Dortman connection for a Neymar today and some CDM from, or CM from the Brazilian League to give us a little bit more flair and a little bit more dribbling prowess. I do love and enjoy playing with Neymar on this game, but 47th minute after halftime, and we're uh, a little bit lucky to retain possession right here, but Cambiasso does nicely to keep it, and he's just a wonderful all-around player on this game. There's nothing he really does poorly. I think this guy got a little unlucky. He kind of read that I wanted to turn inside and shoot to the far post, but he overcorrected, and we get the goal there in the 49th minute to go ahead, but this was a bit of a dogfight to begin with. I couldn't manage to break his defense down just by that little bit. Agbana, silly yellow card, silly foul right here. He kind of follows through and runs into, uh, um, was it, Ola John's leg. And he ends up crossing this, I think, I don't even think he meant to go far post for a nod back, but it works out for him. He's going to cross this all the way over into the far post, and he's going to nod it back across, which is the right thing to do in that situation. And Matic is there to finish nicely, and he does the, uh, is that the, I think that's the why always me celebration which is a little bit frustrating to uh, to see done against you because that means he's purchased it and that means he's played a lot of games. We, uh, we're actually unable to even purchase that celebration at this point in time. Though on my main account, I would be able to so that uh, <laughs> there's really no room for me to talk about that. In the 53rd minute though, off of kickoff, we do what we have to do and we get forward and uh, think that I'm going to go for Royce and he overcorrects to run outside. Unlucky not to smash that one in. Had he not blocked that, there was no doubt that that was going into the back of the net but we cross it in and Lissandra Lopez fights for positioning at the far post 
and gets us the goal to put us back in the lead. And at this point forward, I knew I'd crushed his hopes, I'd crushed his dreams, and even with a failed accidental Cambiasso shot right there, we end up retaining possession. It's Marco Royce breaking inside, and he loses his man here. That's going to go top net, the best net. Two-goal lead, it is done, 83rd minute. We're going to be getting three points. We just need one point from our final two matches, and we'll have won the Division I title yet again, which is all good things and exactly what we want to see. Uh, as far as other things going on today, I will be streaming, so stay tuned. I'll try to upload a video for that. I'm not certain if I will, but I will indeed try to. Otherwise, stay tuned to my Facebook, which is facebook.com slash FIFA. Stay tuned to my Twitter, which is twitter.com slash FIFA as well. Or you can head over to my twitch.tv slash FIFA now and click the follow button so you get an email when I go live, if that is something that you indeed are interested in. Other than that, I want to thank you guys for your incredible support. We uploaded five videos yesterday in order to complete the weekend six-pack. So if you guys did miss any of those, the playlist for the Path to Power will be in the description down below, as will the Career Mode playlist. I hope to see you guys in my stream later. If you did enjoy this, a like or thumbs up is always greatly appreciated. Other than that, my name is Japes, and I will catch you all next time.